And he was a guy they were throwing it to early in the year. Nice feed from Butler. And the dunk by Flo Thumba. And Butler comes away with it. Butler lobs it up. Look up and look out. Mark Vital. That is not great defense. Meyer turns it over. James gives it up. Gorgeous feed that time. He is playing at such a high level. What a big time pass that was. Christian James fires the three and connects for the first time. Meyer to Gillespie's second straight trip. He's left wide open. Now Maddox will fire with 10 on the shot clock. Butler all the way, and the Baylor lead is up to 15. Butler tries a three, and he's got it again, and the lead is up to 18. How difficult is that to do mid-season when you lose as a big time block that time by Thumba? Here's the enemy. Batted away by Vital. What a weapon he's been on the back end of that defense, and Mason takes one of the eyes. Where does the offense come from for Oklahoma? Odoms. And an opportunity for a three-point play, and they need it. Down on the shot clock. Mason draws the double team. Gives it up. Nice-looking feed, and the finish by Kegler. Two weeks to go in Stillwater. They won last week in Morgantown, and they are putting on a clinic here in Norman tonight. Bandu in the open floor, what a move. I saw them on Saturday, and it was the best I've seen them as Iowa State. And we know how good they are offensively. They've got five guys in that starting lineup who can give you a bucket. Come out and they play so well on Saturday against Vanderbilt. And well, they're not going to get the better of both Drew brothers, I can tell you that. Mason with two on the shot clock. Look at that from Makai Mason. <laughs> Off the glass and in for Butler. And what has gone right for Oklahoma? Look at Butler lob it up. And it's thrown home by Darius Allen. Just like the rest of this building, I'm stunned. A 30-point road win.